Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuvir. In this class, we will discuss about special keyboard problem. So the explanation is completely based on the assumption you already have some basic coding knowledge. If you are not good at basic coding, please visit our website learningmonkey.in. Take the course placement training for service based companies, then come for the competitive coding. Coming to today's example, given a special keyboard, they are going to give you a special keyboard. On that keyboard, we are having four keys, key one, print A on the screen. If you press key one, it is going to print A on the screen. Key two, whatever there on the screen, select all the content on screen. It is going to select the content that present on the screen. If two A's are there, it is going to select two A's. Third key is used to copy selected content. So when you press third key, it is going to select the whatever the content you selected, it is going to copy that. So fourth key is paste selected content onto the screen. You, you copied two A's, if you, if you press fourth key, it is going to display two A's on the screen. So this is what the keys are on the keyboard. Our question here is find maximum number of A's that can be displayed on the screen by pressing special keyboard n times. If you are given chance to press n times the special keyboard, how many, the maximum number of A's you can display on the screen. So that is what needed. Let's take an example and understand if n is equal to 3. What's the maximum number of A's you are going to display on the screen? First time, print A, print A, print A. Means first key, first key, key 1, key 1, key 1. So the maximum you can press is, you can display on the screen is 3. Similarly, n is equal to 6. Here we are having two options, you understand this. First time, print A, print A, print A. After that, we are given an option. Select the content, fourth time, this is fourth time. Select the content on the screen. How many A's are there? Three A's are there. Selected, copied, display. 3 plus 3, total how many times? six times so after six if you if you are given chance n is equal to six the maximum number you are going to display is six years this is one option otherwise print here 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 six times you are going to get six similarly similarly if n is equal to seven what's the options you are going to have so first three options a a a we are going to display a a a after that Select, copy, paste means four, five, six options. What we have done? Fourth time we selected the content. How? What is the content that present on the screen? A, A, A. It, we selected that. We copied A, A, A and we displayed A, A, A. So three plus three total. How many times? Six times. So this is when it is there on the option six. Seventh time again paste it. Already you selected, copied, pasted. Again paste it. How many A's you are selected? Three A's has been selected. Seventh time you display again three A's. So total three A's, three A's, three A's, nine A's. Output is nine. So these type of questions, these type of questions, uh, if you write the example step by step, you are going to get the logic. Uh, we need to identify the logic from the sequence of steps, which we are going to follow in the example. Once you identified the logic, it is very, very simple to write the code. So let's try to understand the logic. What's the logic we are going to use here? Uh, okay. See here. Let's take the example. Suppose uh, for six times, what is the maximum possibility? Six times. Six years can be displayed. One time. If n is equal to 1, the, the uh, upper options are n. n is equal to 1, n is equal to 2, n is equal to 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Just writing the example, we need to identify the logic from this example. n is equal to 1, we can press a. Like that, n is equal to 6, uh, 6 times. 1, 1 time, 2, 2 times, 3, 3 times, 4, 4 times, 5, 5 times, 6, 6 times. Seventh option. See, what is the possibility we are going to have here? Whenever you are in the seventh option, the logic goes like this. See here, move three steps back. Why we are moving three steps back? Understand it. Select, copy, paste. This is the option we have. How many steps we need to do this? Three steps. 
that's why we are moving three steps back from here onwards seven to three steps back seven minus three n minus three when you are at the position n n is equal to seven n minus three is seven n minus three means seven minus three four so what is the maximum value you are going to get at four how many a's you have displayed already up here four a's has been displayed so from fifth option select copy paste that is what uh, this n minus 3 says why we are going three steps back uh, three steps back we are having an option of uh, one step select second step copy third step uh, display so up to here up to four how many have been selected how many a's has been printed on the screen four a's has been set printed on the screen uh, select means select four a's copy means copy four a's display means print four a's four plus four how many total eight so two multiplied by four is equal to eight this is one of the option another option is also there go n minus four portions see n minus four seven minus four means three third position print 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 how many a's you have printed three a's has been printed select copy paste means fourth option is fourth key is select copy paste so how many we have selected three a's has been selected select copy paste up to here six a's again paste how many selected three a's has been selected so nine so this is one option this is another option three times n minus four whatever the value that present in n minus fourth position three times because we are having an option of select copy paste one time means we have selected whatever there before the one time selected one uh, we displayed one time again displayed so total three multiplied by n minus four those many yes are possible this is one time this is this three option select copy paste is one time paste is one time three 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 total nine or you go n minus five position seven minus five second position well, how many years we have displayed up to here two years first year second year two years select copy paste 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 so n minus five four multiplied by n minus five these are the options we go three steps back four steps back five steps back when we go three steps back you are having two multiplied by n minus three when you are going four steps back three multiplied by n minus four whatever the value that present here because when you are going four steps back means select copy paste paste that's why three multiplied by n minus four when you are going five steps back means select copy select copy paste 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 so total four multiplied by n minus five option this is the logic we use here to identify step by step we are going so that is what out of these three options which one is the maximum that we are going to select so 2 multiplied by 4 which is 8 3 multiplied by 3 which is 9 4 multiplied by 2 which is 8 which one is maximum 9 so 9 yes we are going to display at the option 7 similarly for option 8 go 3 steps go 4 steps go 5 steps out of this which one is the maximum similarly 9 like that each 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 position if you are taking n times you, how many times you are going to execute the loop initially six are common after that start from seven onwards up to n minus n nth position see one more we will do one more example for 10 whenever you are at 10 so 10 minus 3 which one we got seven what is the maximum number of years we are going to display here nine years from here onwards you are having three options three keys you can press after seven times what is the maximum value you are having a nine select select means nine years has been selected copy nine years has been copied paste nine plus nine 18 that is what uh, 10 means 2 multiplied by 9 which is 18 this is one of the option 
अदरवाइज गो फोर स्टेप्स बैक थ्री मल्टीप्लाइड बाय फोर टेन माइनस फोर विच इज सिक्स वट इज द मैक्सिम नंबर ऑफ इयर्स यू आर गोइंग टू डिस्प्ले अप टू हियर सिक्स सो थ्री टाइम्स सिक्स विच इज एटीन सिमिलरली फाइव स्टेप्स बैक टेन माइनस फाइव फाइव वट इज द मैक्सिम नंबर ऑफ इयर्स यू आर गोइंग टू डिस्प्ले हियर फाइव फोर टाइम्स फाइव which is 20 out of these three which one is maximum 18 18 20 which one is maximum 20 so this is the option we have at at 10th position when you press the key 10 times you are going to display maximum of 20 as if you are given an option to display to use the keyboard 10 times at 10th time the maximum number of as you are going to display on the screen is 20 as similarly 11 12 so on if you apply 10 times you are going to get the last one is going to be our output so these type of questions identifying this logic is difficult writing the code is very very easy it takes time to identify this logic it's general intuition general basic mathematical intuition you are going to get this logic so coming to the coding part we are going to show you the coding part here after listening to the logic you try to solve it on your own that is the best practice any way coding is available in our website learningmonkey.in you can copy it and uh, you can use the code so for n is equal to range 1 to 7 screen n minus 1 is equal to c array index starts from uh, uh, 0 onwards that's why it is going to take a screen of uh, n minus 1 n minus 1th position you are going to display n value similarly for a uh, from now on what's for n in range of 7 to n plus 1 you do this logic maximum of identify the maximum of uh, the three options uh, and place it in the n minus 1th position uh, array index starts from 0 that's why n minus 1th position hope you understand this example if you have any questions regarding the concept please post your questions in the comment section below thanks for watching if you haven't subscribed to our channel please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates thank you